everyone. So, um, Ross stole my camera this week and started vlogging on it. So, even though I have plenty of my own things to talk about, example, um, Barry and Mindy, my former best friend, hooking up and him giving her my promise ring because, you know, that's totally okay and normal to do after a really serious relationship with somebody else. Just other than that, I have nothing to say. Whereas Ross, he, he has a lot to say because, uh, you know, he's, he's Ross. Okay, now, let's see here. Getting the lighting right is really hard outside. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Okay. That, that looks... Okay. Okay, okay, let's see. <clears throat> uh, okay. Um, so, uh, Monica told me that I should try the whole vlogging thing because apparently it's a good way to work out your problems, according to Grace and Frankie. But, you know, Grace and Frankie also ignore the existence of bisexuals, so I don't really know if they're a reliable source of information. <laughs> and so, uh, how do I even start on a rant like this? I guess I could start with the fact that my girlfriend of four years decided to leave me because she thinks Susan Bunch understands her better. Because she likes Susan Bunch more than me. And I mean, huh? <laughs> Why? Susan Bunch isn't even pretty. She's like a six at best. I guess me and my girlfriend have different tastes in women. <laughs> I, I just don't get it. We were so good together. We got along so well. And it's not that she doesn't find men attractive. It's not even that she doesn't like men. It's just that she doesn't love me anymore. And, and it, it just hurts. It hurts like crazy because people who don't know anything keep making jokes about how my girlfriend turned gay and about how I must have been really terrible in bed for to make a woman give up on men completely. And it's just, it's just so irritating because not only do I have to deal with the fact that my girlfriend is leaving me for someone else, but I have to deal with stupid jokes like that. Oh. I just... And now... And now she's pregnant. She's pregnant because I was stupid and irresponsible and got caught up in the moment on our anniversary. And now I'm... We're, we're going to have a kid. And she doesn't even want to try to make us work. She, she doesn't even... I might not get to spend any time with my own kid. And I just, I just don't know what to do. My parents, I, I, I told them this morning, and, and my mom is basically in a catatonic state, and my dad has been chain smoking and watching Cheers reruns for the past 12 hours. I don't even know what's gonna happen once they figure out what they wanna do to me. I'm just, I'm just so, just so sad. Everything really, really, really sucks right now. Hey, are you alright, big brother? I'm really not. It's okay. You're going to be.